Hi there guys, Brandon at Cosmic Comics. Today we're having a look at a brand new Minico figure. Uh, here we've got the Infinity Saga Hulk. Um, so first off we're just going to have a look at the box, box art, what sort of contents on the actual uh, packaging and then we'll pull it out. So here on the side, as always, they've got the uh, uh, artwork. Obviously it's the, the concept sketch for the actual figure. It looks very cool. You'll notice the actual Infinity Saga text has like a weird uh, uh, like metallic finish. Obviously under different lights it will reflect differently. Uh, yeah, on the back of the box, not much to see, although um, they've actually shown you that there's going to be a Hulkbuster that's going to go along with this, but uh, these aren't available just yet, so uh, keep an eye on our Facebook page and our website, so as soon as pre-orders open, obviously we'll go and we'll go and advertise them up on there. Once again, this is part of the uh, Heroes line, so it looks like they're, they're doing something similar to how Funko does theirs, uh, where you'll have like a, a pop television, pop Star Wars, that type of thing, so it looks like they might be doing the same kind of, same kind of thing here as well. Cool, let's pull this out. So this thing is massive, as, as it was expected to be. Uh, sort of similar size to the Thanos. I think it might even be just a little bit taller, because obviously it is elevated. Um, lots of cool little uh, 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 like textures and stuff going on in the base and in the fabric of the pants, as you can see if you have a closer look there. The colors in this are really nice as well. Let's actually just have a closer look here at some of the details. So you'll see they've obviously painted on some body hair there. Some cool little uh, like veins. It's also just painted on it, it's not really sculpted I don't think. Some dirt on the toes and the feet. Lots of little like textures and pores in the concrete underneath him. Tar. You can see the veins and the dirt on his arms. Very nice. Uh, bottom of the base, not too much to see. They're not. Uh, they don't have any sort of like limited number on them or anything like that. So yeah, and then also you'll notice these are these are PVC statues. So it's a plastic statue, and it, it's one solid piece. So it's no, there's no moving pieces, and it doesn't clip out of the base or anything like that. It's one solid statue. But yeah, these are in stock now. They're available uh, in store as well as online. Um, yeah, we'll just leave a link at the end of the video so you guys can go check them out for yourselves. And then as we've shown before, this is probably the, the cooler way to display them. If you've got a big enough shelf, you can obviously have your box behind it with the art facing outward, and then you have the figure in front of it. I think that looks quite cool. Anyhow, that's, uh, that's just a short video showing you guys what it looks like. Uh, thanks for watching. Uh, don't forget to like and leave a subscribe there if you guys want to see more content like this in the future. Thanks, guys.